Hey guys, what's up? This is guy and in today's video, we talking about things that Vossar could do to change bad sport. So without the other way, let's get right to this video. They got one thing I just want to let you know, I got bad sport for 4 months. So if you want to add me, my game attack is H1 4x4. The way it's spelled is H1 4x4. So if you want to play with me in bad sport, or you just want to help me with a video, just message me. I will be in bad sport all the way to 2018 of March. So this video should be pretty short, cause it's just one thing I really want Rockstar to do. That is remove insurance and the bad sport points off of weaponized vehicles. Now the reason why I say is cause weaponized vehicles could be used to grief players. Now I'm talking about vehicles like the Hydra, the Starling and the Oppressor, it's really the Oppressor and the Hydra is the two main vehicles that need to get the best four points removed off of cause that is what Griefers use the most, especially the Oppressor. The way how I got in Best Boy is pretty stupid. I was getting spawn killed by two oppressors and then I got my vigilante for defense and I used it against the two oppressors and I got Best Boy for destroying one of the oppressors for four months too. So I think that Vasta really need to remove the personal vehicle insurance costs off of weaponized vehicles and remove the Best Boy points too. Only weaponized vehicles for regular civilian vehicles like sport cars, SUVs, off-roaders, just normal aircrafts like the Swift, the Maverick, for those that can keep the insurance costs and the best war points on cause you got no reason to destroy them. Now for weaponized vehicles, just like I said, you could grief with weaponized vehicles and if you want to defend yourself against griefers, you can't get penalty. You shouldn't get a penalty for defending yourself against a griefer in a weaponized vehicle. If you destroy a weaponized vehicle, that should be a compliment. That shouldn't be saying that get you a penalty for destroying a weaponized vehicle. So that is all I want Vasa to do with the bad sport system. Is get rid of the bad sport points on weaponized vehicles and get rid of the expensive $20,000 on the weaponized vehicles too. Cause once you start destroying the oppressor over and over again, that twenty thousand dollars start adding up. Cause I had plus get over eight oppressors on me, and I just kept destroying them over and over again until I left the session. Cause I didn't want to get bad sport. But anyways, three days after getting attacked by oppressor, I got attacked again, and then I got playing bad sport for four months for defend myself against oppressors. Now I think the only thing they should do is have it if you destroy your own person. If you destroy your own weaponized vehicle, you should still pay for your own weaponized vehicles. It should just be if other players destroy your weaponized vehicles, the other players shouldn't have to pay for your weaponized vehicles. It should be only you have to pay for your own insurance on your weaponized vehicle. But anyways, if you're in bad sport, make sure you add me and send me a message to let me know that you add me and tell me that you're in bad sport too. Most times I forget to check my activity, so make sure you say that you added me too. But anyways, before the hunter attack helicopter comes out, I'm gonna put out a montage on how bad sport players play. What they do, they use passive, explosives, shoot RPGs and humming lockers against each other on the ground. So what I do, I just mostly just stay in the star lane or whatever other plane they got. Cause it's just pretty fine using it against them and seeing their reaction against the planes. Most of the time they get the easy way out against them anyways. But I'm gonna post a montage up later on that. So anyways, if you do like this video, make sure you subscribe and leave a like on this video. It's pretty late at night, so sorry if I sound pretty sluggish. So I'm out guys. Peace.